I'm Michael. I'm sitting in my Mitsubishi Outlander PHEV and today I show you how to install the uh, remote Wi-Fi control. Uh, this device is good for for example if you if you want to uh, cool down your car before departure uh, you can set your uh, charging uh, and uh, of course you can get to to the settings inside the car if you replace your head unit with uh, some aftermarket alternative. Well, let's start with uh, uh, Windows laptop. Uh, we need uh, uh, that EV module, of course. You can uh, search for example on eBay or, or some some uh, PHEV related groups on Facebook uh, my uh, my module I bought from from a guy who totaled his outlander and it was like 90 euro to... uh, you also need some basic tools and then you'll need something like this uh, this is uh, Tectrix open port 2.0 uh, it's a module which you can use for access uh, etex uh, settings uh, maybe your normal bluetooth uh, dongle work as well unfortunately my uh, conway kw903 doesn't work for a reason i don't know so i have to buy uh, this usb USB connector, Tactrix open port. So let's start with the mechanical part of the job. Uh, then after we are done, we can we can show some some uh, software related stuff.
so uh, the computer settings are done so now we should connect our mobile application with the car so let's start with uh, resetting the module because uh, if you buy like second hand module uh, there is a limit of two per devices so if they are already connected uh, you cannot add any more uh, any more devices so let's start with a reset uh, you can check uh, the official manual of Mitsubishi uh, they said you should uh, press the button like 20 times so it means 10 times lock 10 times unlock and you just alternate lock unlock uh, until you hear a beep uh, the reset procedure is quite simple uh, we start with uh, hazard lights then we uh, turn the car to ACC mode so it means uh, press once power button without a brake and now uh, let's click lock unlock So, you heard the beep, this means uh, the system is uh, already reset and now you can turn the car off and hazard lights off. So here is the procedure about registration, so close the driver's door, done, uh, turn ACC, uh, done, now click Click the controller. You hear the beep, so it should work already. Uh, next, and here you uh, you select the Wi-Fi. So just wait, wait for it. So I have found the list of networks. This is the one. Now I put my password. The application is connecting to a car. So now it looks the registration is completed. So uh, there it is. It's char charging schedule, climate control. So let's start the uh, air conditioning. Let's stop here. Okay. Ten minutes. Let's turn it on. So everything seems to be working fine. So I think the project is done. So thank you for watching and hope it helps to you if you decide to do the same. So bye bye.